Hello guys, in this video we'll tell you how to fix screen rotation log grayed out on Windows 10 or 11. Before we start the video guys, if you have any computer or software related problems, please feel free to contact us by visiting our website and using the submit a problem button from there. And comment down below on our videos about your problem and don't worry, we'll make a video for you to resolve it. Number 1. Disconnect any external devices. Note. You might not be able to use a screen rotation lock if your convertible laptop or tablet is attached to a detachable keyboard. This is according to Windows. Consequently, you want to start by unplugging it. Number 2. Use the keyboard shortcut. The default keyboard shortcut for screen rotation is Ctrl plus Alt plus the arrow keys. Press and hold Ctrl and Alt. Then use the arrow key corresponding to the desired rotation direction. It can be up, down, left or right. Number 3. Modify the display orientation settings. For this, access the window setting by pressing the window plus i key together and from the list of possible options, select system. After that, go to the display orientation section in the right panel and from there, select portrait from the menu by expanding the drop down menu. Number 4. Re-enable sensors from device manager. For this, display the run dialog box by pressing the window plus R key together and in the run dialog box, type devmgmt.msc into the box and hit enter. After that, right click on your driver and expand sensors and then choose disable device. Next, choose enable device by performing a second right click on your sensor driver. Number 5. Update your screen settings. For this, again display the settings by pressing the window plus i key together and from the list of possible options, again select system. After that, go to the display orientation settings in the right panel and last but not the least, make sure the rotation log is activated in the scale and layout area. Number 6. Restart the sensor monitoring service. For this, press window plus r key to again display run dialog box and in the run dialog box, Type services.msc and press enter to open the services window. After that, scroll down and find the sensor monitoring service option. Then, right click on it and select restart option. If the service is not running, click start first and then choose restart option. Number 7. Check for windows updates. For this, press window plus i key to open the window settings. After that, click on update and security option. Then, in the update and security window, Click on window update in the left hand side menu. Then click on check for updates and let windows search for any available updates and will automatically install them. After the updates are installed, just simply restart your computer and check if the brightness control function gear function correctly or not. Number 8. Try updating your graphic drivers. For this, press window plus R key to open run box and from there type devmgmt.msc and click OK to open the device manager. Then in the device manager window, expand the display adapter section. It will list all the graphic drivers installed on your computer. Do the following for all of the drivers. Here are some options. Right click on display driver and choose uninstall driver option. Make sure to uncheck the delete that driver software for this device option in the pop-up if it shows up. Then go to the top menu in device manager and under the action tab, Select scan for hardware changes. The driver should appear back in the list. If it does not, don't worry. Just simply restart your PC and it will appear back. Then right click on display driver and choose update driver. And select search automatically for drivers. Window will automatically scan for available driver updates and will automatically download them. Then just simply restart your PC to apply the changes. If it didn't work, again right click on display driver and choose update driver. But this time, select Browse my computer for driver software. Then, select Let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Then, select the driver you want to install. Generally, it is a pre-selected top option in the list and click Next. After that, just simply restart your PC to apply the changes. If even that doesn't work, you can try going to a laptop or graphic card manufacturer's official website and downloading the latest driver for a specific model from there. And then simply install the driver and again restart your PC to apply the changes. Number 9. Enable sensors in Windows. For this, press the Windows key and go to Settings, the gear icon. 
and select devices and then sensors from there. And make sure that allow the computer to turn off the device to save power option is unchecked. After that, just simply click apply and then OK. Number 10. Use the third party software. If none of the above methods work, you can try using third party software to enable screen rotation log grayed out. So this was it for the video guys. We hope this video helped you solve your problem. If it did, then make sure that you give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. And if it did not, then don't worry. Just comment down below the issue and we'll try to figure out what is wrong with your specific case. Thank you for watching.